Although I'm big on constraining the knowledge implicit in a piece of software, like I want my objects to be ultra specialized, I want you know, to have these distinct contexts and within them I have only one model and you know, that, that model is very decoupled from other models and other contexts and so on. But I don't think that way at all about the people involved. I mean, I want the person to know as much about the whole situation as possible, right? There's no need for people to respect the boundaries of a bounded context in the knowledge that they acquire. I mean, uh, you know, we're way too compartmentalized as people. It's the, you know, we have to keep reminding ourselves that my boundaries should be much broader than the boundaries of the software I'm writing. You know, I need to understand the context within which this software operates, and that's much bigger than the software. And uh, I think it's, it's weird. I, I, I mean, saying it out loud, it sounds ridiculous, but I have observed that people really do sort of make decisions about what knowledge they should acquire very much in alignment with the knowledge that will be in their software. Like they'll hear, like for example, one of the things that, uh, you know, one of the strict things we do in Agile is we don't over engineer, right? We don't try to accommodate cases beyond the ones we've got. But people extend that to saying, I shouldn't understand those other cases. I shouldn't understand the business beyond these little cases, these little stories. Well, I couldn't disagree more. I think in order to even understand the story, really understand the story you're working on right now, you need to know a lot about the environment that that story is happening in. And uh, so I think people should know, you know, as much as possible about, uh, yeah. Encapsulation is for objects, not for people. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>